Greetings, YouTube. Happy Monday. We have heard rumblings about Cyber Weekend on Twitter and in some banners, even though mine still never got updated. But in the in-game inbox announcement, we have two things. A four-star class bundle to talk about. But let's first talk about Cyber Weekend sales. All right. They say, oh my gosh, to Tuesday. My goodness. Cyber Weekend will be running from Friday, November 29th to Tuesday, December 3rd. That's a long time, y'all. Expect big bonuses when buying units and special offers that weekend. These offers will be tailored to your current story progression in the game. If you're close to becoming uncollected by completing Act 5, Chapter 2, Level 40 Plus, or Cavalier, then this is your chance to power up your team, add to your roster, and push forward. This sale is a great chance to stock up on some much-needed resources for new challenges on the horizon like the conclusion of Act 6 or the twisted depths of the upcoming Abyss of Legends. Unlike previous years, we'll be running this sale all four days. The sales presented will not be altered or added to during the Cyber Weekend. Okay, well, that's good at least. So don't wait, don't delay, and don't miss out on these spectacular offers while you can get them. So it seems like if you're running the sale all four days, it's just going to have a four-day window. And you're not going to get new offers every day, which is what I thought would happen. The confusing thing is that... Uh, one of these days, or two of these days, is going to come at the beginning of December, which is normally when the daily calendars come out. So I wonder if that's going to be in addition to this. But it does say that they will not be altered or added during the Cyber Weekend. So, all right. Well, that's good, I guess. It gives you four days to ask Grandma for uh, her $5, you know, check. But let's uh, let's grade this. Let's talk about this. This is for... Those of you who have become a contender <laughs> woo, by completing Act 2. Boy, what skill. All right. You get a four-star of a specific class, a rank-up gem for one to two, a rank-up gem from two to three, and some gold. Now, let me be clear. If you are somebody who is in the contender status, if you downloaded the game recently, and if you're fighting with mostly three stars, I guess, this would be tempting. But it's priced at a 2017 price point. We have seen several offers, not the like once a year amazing offers, but just several normal offers that give a four star anywhere from five to $10. And the best offer, of course, being the ultimate daily card where you get a four star over the course of 14 days, just based off of shards plus a 20% chance to get a four star out of an ultimate crystal every day during that time span. But even if you're just talking about those normal offers, 10 bucks at max, but closer to five is what I'd put the value of a four star crystal in 2019, almost 2020. Though I will say that this is not just a four star, of course, it's a rank up to rank three, which would I value that at $10 total? No, I would not. I would value both of these items, given what we've seen, at about $5, making the maximum of, uh, of this offer. I still think it should be 10 bucks. 10 bucks would be a solid deal to kick off Cyber Weekend Week, and it would give us the opportunity to, most importantly, uh, just embrace some value before throwing your cash and or units at offers come Friday. However, that's just not the case here. This is double the price tag, and if you're going to put $20 as the price tag and keep it there, you should at least let them take the class-based four-star to rank four, which would mean including a rank-up gem that saves some tier four basic. Keep in mind that for $10 more, we have seen a couple of times now in 2019 the rank-up gem rank four to rank five for a four-star where you not only save those very precious Tier 4 class catalysts, because you need three per four-star to take to rank five, but also you got things like signature stones, and in one case, even an awakening gem. I am not impressed at all for this, but then again, if you're opening this up to people who are contender, you're trying to milk the newbies who don't know any better and are willing to overpay to get ahead because you'd rather have a four-star, even if it's a four-star Groot, then um, keep fighting with like a three-star Satan herself, Kamala Khan. Either way, this should be 10 bucks, or as it stands, this should include at least a gem from rank three to rank four, as well as the others 
that already packaged, including a pretty pathetic amount of gold and 50000 This is to dupe newbies. Hopefully they will see this video and know to save their money for four days from now when we kick off Cyber Weekend on Friday. Hope you have a good one, YouTube. Happy Monday. Thanks for watching and supporting the Marvel Contest of Champions YouTube channel.